So good morning everybody. This is Carlos, the running jackal, in his neighborhood. Taking you on a short hike, a short but brisk hike. I was uh, out already today. This is my second outing and it's only 10 in the morning. I uh, went up to see the pigs today with Norma, our Wednesday outing. Just a short outing today because uh, I didn't have to go all the way up to Sydney because both of my running buddies up at that end of the peninsula are out of action. Derek, I'm not sure what's going on with him, but he appears to have some kind of heart issue. And John, because the weather is now getting nicer, is being asked to work again for his landscaping friends. So he's out of action from the running point of view. But, uh, you know, I still have to get out. It's my duty to my body to get something done. So, the recording started today at the weir and the weir I'm going to go from the weir to the meadows to Glen Denning that is going to be my route today and Harvest Lane home I'm going to take you on the forest section the forest of fun Somebody taking a speedy right turn. Okay, so now I should leave the noise behind. This is where I part company with the cars. I'm trying to stay in the sunshine today having got previously chilled getting here thus far today 25 kilometers of breezy e-bike but uh, it gave me a taste for the sunshine I want to see more of this I recently purchased I recently purchased one of those activity wearables, one of those sports watches. Not the Apple Watch. No no. Not the Garmin watch. No no. Something seventy dollars worth of technology basically a fancy dancy step counter but it's linked to my phone and the world via Bluetooth. It's kind of handy actually. First of all what I really wanted was a regular old Timex watch. The ones that we all grew up with us young runners were when we were young that's all we had the sports watch was a Timex Ironman that we very soon learned how to do the five things that you could do with a Timex Ironman watch this new watch of mine can take my heart rate my blood pressure, 
my VO2 oxygen blood levels. I don't know what else it can do, but it could monitor my sleep somehow and tell me if I'm dreaming. I mean, it's all Mickey Mouse, really, if you think about it. It's based on movement, which is the step counter. And, uh, hello. Hang on. Getting busy here. Dogs and people everywhere. Okay. Dispatched with them quite easily. Everybody's just so eager to get out and enjoy spring. Mind you, it is still cold, as I was saying. The e-bike ride this morning was not warm. So much so that Norma had those chemical hand warmers, those little pouches that you activate by shaking, and then you put them inside your glove. Anyway. I made the mistake of not bringing my gloves in last time I was on the e-bike. I got slightly wet and uh, they didn't dry out because most of the year the humidity level is high here so without direct sunshine and breeze things don't really dry too well. Especially not if they're just inside my cycle helmet, hanging from the handlebars of my e-bag. That's probably the worst possible way of trying to dry gloves. Anyway, I'm going to take a few photographs pretty soon. I'm going to wait till I get to the meadows, because today... I'm excited that I might see the first of the camas. Sunday's show was called Looking for the Camus Lilies. And this show is not yet named. But it's going to have hike in it somewhere. For some reason today, I'm very accelerated. My cadence is high today, even though I do have a sore ankle. So I'm on Todd Trail now, heading towards Glendenning and eventually the meadows. That's where I'm most likely to see the uh, camas. I'm going to flip my sunglasses up because they're kind of not needed now. I'm in the forest. Hello. You have a dog up there? Yeah, not a very big one, but it's good. Like that. Is it a yapper? No. Good. Hello, little dog. I've seen this dog before. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what a kitty. That way. Let's go, man. Yeah, I've seen that dog before. No and I saw him just the other day with his his foster mother. Alright, so I'm climbing, climbing, climbing. Can you guys hear the music? I think so. It's there. Mind you, my recorder is at the end of my arms. And it's hanging down low as I lean into the hill, breathing hard. I don't have my heart rate 
monitor on my arm today because for a hike I have one mounted on my wrist. I just have to look at my wrist and I'll be able to see what's going on. In fact, yep, one fifteen heart rate. It's got a touch screen for flipping modes. This is my sports watch. It's a bit like a fancy Fitbit with a round dial. But it takes more of a, than just a, just a gentle turn of my wrist to activate the screen. So I find myself sometimes shaking it vigorously to get a reading, which is less than optimum behavior, in my opinion. All right, so I've got my description of the route mixed up a little bit at the beginning today. I was visualizing approaching the meadows from a slightly different side, but it's okay. I'm now going up Glendening towards the cave. This is the hill that I normally do my hill repeats on. I am borrowing in air quotes music from my friend Jebber Norton from Shakedown Street the six hour extravaganza of Grateful Deadness every single week he's as consistent as I am with his shows. Here comes a young red, red setter. Morning. This is my hill repeat zone. Did I just say that? A couple of big dogs. Hello, dog. Hi. I'm saying hi to the dog lady. Dog posed more of a threat than you did. But thank you for saying hi back. For your dog. Sweet mama, the elm roof. Okay, so now I am actually hiking downhill. Heart rate of 91. Alright, I get a bit of a break now because it's flat. I'm traversing the hill of happiness, past the lying sculpture, the tree nude. Yeah, well, this is a bit of a of a hiking adventure for me today. Workout average pace ten minutes fifty four seconds per kilometer. Still managing to keep up an incredibly fast pace for this hike. I have not run one single solitary step. Up I go again. 
That was my downhill break. So this watch also can control my music. I can link it to my health app and link it to Strava. Not directly. Hello. Hello. How are you? I'm well. How many dogs do you have today? There's nine. Nine? Wow. Hello. Your dogs are always so well behaved. Oh, I like them? It's yeah. Here. They get lots of good exercise. Okay, so they're going to be following me for a little while, I believe. Yep, I hear the jangle of a dog tag behind me. Nine of them. She has nine dogs under her control. And they are very well controlled. I must say that about those dogs. Alright, so now I'm getting into Camus territory again. And the nine dogs are still on my tail. So this is this ascent to uh, Little Mount Doug. I would take a photograph but unfortunately the nine dogs behind me are obliging me to walk a little faster, a little faster to get away from them. But that's okay. They have as much right to these trails as I do. So 11 minute pace. I don't wear my heart rate strap mostly when I'm hiking now. But as I have the, the heart rate monitor on my wrist, on my watch, on my rinky dinky $70 sports watch, I can always check that. I'm taking a bit of an evasive route here. I saw a woman coming towards me on a piece of single track. Wow, this is really nice. Hang on a second, I'm going to take some photographs while I'm at it. I'm going to pause this. Okay, so I've had my photo opportunity for today. No camas, unfortunately, yet. But getting close. Taking that evasive route has now put the pack of nine ahead of me slightly so I'm going to try and get ahead of them now it's not guaranteed no. maybe now I'm going to get past them good dogs We're all looking for the sun today. Yeah. <laughs> it's glorious, isn't it? So I'm now ahead of the pack of nine. I think that's going to have to come into the title somehow today, unless something more memorable happens. This episode will be called ahead of the pack of nine. Still 
keeping a pretty good average pace. I'm now actually inside the roped off area. This is now uh, a no-go zone for hikers, so I'm actually breaking the rules here a little bit. But that's okay. I can do that. I have been respectful as I step over the rope. There she goes again. I took the shortcut. I saw her coming down, going down as I was going up. Hello. That guy had a huge camera hanging from his neck. I should have checked how many minutes of recording I have, but I guess it's, it is what it is. Alright, so undulations again now. Undulations. Ankle busting rocks. But no surface water, which is great news. Actually, avoiding that woman took me on a whole mystery trip onto the back of the roped off area as I wiggle my way back down to uh, Glendening again and I'll be crossing over to Harvest Lane from there let me just check on this recording so 23 minutes Getting close to my end of program. Workout average pace 11 minutes 16 seconds per kilometer. Yep. It has been fast but tricky progress. I'm quite surprised that I still am in sub 12 minute pace. It gets progressively easier now. Downhill now. Hi. Hello, dog. Two dogs and a woman coming up. Hello, people. Hi, dogs. She was clearing the trail of broken branch. There has been a lot of wind damage the last two days here in the Forest of Fun. Some trees have been returned to their soil. Well, they will be in the next hundred years or so, back to dirt. Between the termites and the uh, woodpeckers, they will be picked to bits. And then the rot of the, of the winter. Hello again. Yep. I'm seeing everybody twice today. It's like deja vu all over again. So close to running, but with a sore foot 
the options were either no show or no recorded show anyway just an e-bike ride but I thought no I can do more than this one hour is not enough I'm giving up three hours of training by not going all the way up to Sydney to run with the boys so I figured an hour of hiking would make up nicely up I go there's Peter Pan Wales Doctor Doctor Give me the news. The doctor, Mr. MD. And up again. This trail will take me to the Glendenning turnoff to Harvest Lane. I will take you to the end of this tune. Okay, I will see you again on Sunday. I'll speak to you then. Bye-bye.